This is the Adventurer 30T from Winnebago. This coach is built on an 18,000 pound Ford chassis, has a V10 gasoline engine, six speed automatic transmission, carries 80 gallons of fuel. There's four different full body paint options available on the outside of the Adventurer. Side swing luggage doors and pass through storage are standard on all the Adventures as is the fiberglass roof, the superstructure steel cab, the interlocking wall system, and the aluminum underbelly. A lot of great storage space in here. You can also see there's a dedicated spot for a pet leash or a security cable. If you were had bikes or something, outside LP hookup for a grill or a heater or a mosquito magnet. More storage bins, does have a gravity water fill, electric awning standard with LED light strip. This bin goes almost all the way across, great place for flag poles, fishing poles. 5,000 pound towing capacity with a 7 pin connector. Has the Onan 5500 generator auto changeover switch. There's a park cable input. There's two inputs for portable satellites. A water pump switch, very convenient out in the utility bay. Hot and cold water. Another nice storage bin made into the side of the slide. If we come forward, this is where the Sewer dumps are black tank flush. Again, you can see the lights in each compartment. The entire basement on this coach is heated, lighted and heated. Side turn cameras are available. This is the other side of the pass-through storage bin. Again, you're seeing the lights in there. Some resettable 12-volt breakers. This happens to be the frost gray exterior. Now let's go inside. As we come inside the 30T, you step over the dual house batteries located in the entry step. Looking forward on the coach, you have two different wood choices, and then you have four different interior choices in all of the adventurers. Standard build items include dual glazed windows, day-night MCD roller shades in the front part of the coach. There's a secondary table that goes between the driver and passenger seat. Power front shade which can also act as your visor. There's plenty of power plugs in the front. There's also a flip down workstation and it has additional 12 volt plugs. The large 10 inch backup monitor Sirius Satellite is an option on here. New for 2020 is the speaker. If you had your phone Bluetooth, is now located on the dash. Things like a park radio switch, battery boost, automatic hydraulic levelers, power mirrors, those are all standard build items. The Versa swivel seat, it is a power seat but you can see that the driver's seat will actually turn around. The passenger seat also has a kick-out footrest. You have two 13,500 BTU air conditioners. Both of them have heat strips in them. There's two additional chairs and a leaf in the back part of the coach. The TV conveniently goes up and down on an electric motor. You can put it away if you have a great view out the window. The new bamboo sink covers, flip up countertop extension. All of the controls conveniently located at the mid part of the coach. The 30T has a LP and electric water heater. All your slide room controls. This one did get the optional solar. It's also Wi-Fi ready at the front of the coach. 
nice big pantry. Thirty T features a split bathroom. As you're headed to the back of the coach, shower with glass door on the left. The main bathroom door will turn and stay open, and then you have a partition that'll pull off across from the bedroom. Basically, make it into a three room coach. Plenty of room and counter space in the bath area. Again, the shower, there's some storage items in there. You take a look in the bedroom, you have the dual closets padded headboard. You have plugs on either side of the bed. Storage over the bed. The bed will also lift up. That's where the additional chairs are. The 30T, if you look on the corner, you can remove that panel. We call that a pet palace area. So if you had a dog or cat that wanted to hide underneath the bed, you simply pull that up and they can have access to that area underneath the bed. Again, that's the extra chairs. You can also see the ladder for the studio loft up in the front, which that is an option. Here's a secondary table stowed for travel that can go up in the front part of the coach. Bedroom TV mounted above the window. Now, let's close up the 30T and take a look at the coach as it's being made ready for travel. Bringing in the bedroom slide first. In the bedroom area, the bed does touch all the way up to the drawers below. The Power Gear electric slide system always have the engine running. You have to have the parking brake set. It is a very good idea to always have the engine running. Now we'll bring in the front slide, the 30T. Even though it has opposing front slides, it travels very well. Driver's side slide will come in first. Then we'll bring in the passenger side slide, and you can see that you still have a nice pathway to get through the front. Again, this is the 30T Adventurer by Winnebago.